subscribe to this channel and turn on your notification bell icon. Thank you. APC appoints Oshomole, Onyegun, Ganduje, and 47 others for Iziamu's governorship campaign. In what could turn out to be a melodramatic, the ruling All Progressive Congress, APC, has named two of its former national chairman, Chief John Odigi Onyegun, and Comrade Adams Oshomole into its National Campaign Council for the Edo State Governorship election. The party, in a statement by its Deputy National Publicity Secretary, Mr. Yekini Nabana, said its caretaker or extraordinary National Convention Planning Committee, headed by Governor Maimala Buni, gave the approval. It added that the Kano State Governor, Dr. Ablahi Omaganduje, is to chair the 47-49 member National Campaign Council, while Imo State Governor Senator Hope Ozodima will serve as Deputy Chairman and Honorable Abbas Brimo as Secretary. There has been no love lost since 2018 when Comrade Adams Oshomole, with the backing of some stakeholders in the party, aged out of Chief Odigi Onyegun as national chairman. Although Odigi Onyegun served out his four-year term, there was attempts by the handlers to get him a tenor extension, an ambition that was shot out down by Oshomole. However, the library between the duo became more pronounced ahead of the now-conducted APC governorship primary in the state. Why Chief Odegi Onyegun backed the incumbent Mr. Godwin Obaseke, Oshomole supported Pastor Osage Iziamu, who has since emerged as the party's candidate. His emergence forced Chief Odegi Onyegun to larry other stakeholders to call for the dissolution of the National Working Committee, NWC, led by Comrade Adams Oshomole. Other members of the campaign council are Senator Ovi Omar Agege, Governor Inua Yahaya, Governor Yahaya Belo, and Babajide Sanuolu. The list also has Senator Aliyu Magadakada, Senator Gosio Ababio, Senator Oji Ozokalo, Senator Owe Lerocha Sokorocha, Tim Pai Silva, Dr. Pius Odubu, Senator Digi, Honorable Abubaka Adagun, and others. This is the news coming from Edo State. <laughs> and I must indeed say that this is one of the funniest news I've heard today. Because I don't know why, why Edo APC have to appoint the... Um, they have to appoint people that are log ahead with each other. Just imagine appointing Comrade Adams to Shomole and, and Onyegun in the same party. If you could recall earlier, Adams to Shomole have been, have been in support of Iziam or why Onyegun have been in support of Obaseke, which have, been, which have gotten the two of them in log ahead. And then some other members of this committee are not also in agreeable terms. Now, APC have appointed them to help Iziamu in his campaign and as he stands now it's as if Iziamu is going nowhere because there is no how people at log ahead to help him campaign in this election it's as if Obaseke is still having an upper hand compared to Iziamu because Iziamu's party is so scattered it's as if he's not making a headway some Nigerians have also noticed this reacted to this news one of the comments I have here said to campaign for the same person APC said he is and was a thief, we should sometimes always believe what to proclaim to be true. I think this person is trying to talk about Iziamu. Then the next comment I have here said, APC has become a laughing stock. Oyegu knows Edo has run only Edo has run not only gone. This one is trying to say that Onyego knows that Edo is not making any headway in terms of APC. Then the next one I have here said, I laugh in betrayal. The way members of that committee will work against APC, I just they laugh. This was the exact thing I complained about and someone is still seeing it in the same view as me. Then the next one I have here said, 
I don't think so. It is just a way to keep someone like Onyegun on check. Okay, let's watch out and see how they will checkmate Onyegun. Then the next one I have here said, Chai Oshomole has turned to houseboy to be taking order from Buni, the chairman. Chai Oshomole, see your life. When will they tell you, you know, one here? Them know they tell person, tell person, hi. Then the next one said, they will all fail by God's grace, a do is not legal state. One other comment I have here said, Gandola will speak a do language in this election. He never sees something. Then the next one I have here said, for Ganduje to have agreed to lead the campaign, it means dollar must be involved. Oh my God, that is a very funny one. Then the last comment I have here said, God will frustrate them in this time around. A do is no legal state and it can never be. That is true, I agree with you. Then you too can as well become part of this discussion by dropping your opinion and what you think concerning this committee of campaigners at the comment section. Please do well subscribe to this channel and do not forget to turn on your notification bell icon to get notified whenever we make any upload. See you in my next video. Thank you.